Arsenal Fan TV at the Tollington pub just chilling after the game and uh, it was a nice victory today really enjoyed that game very very good FA Cup tie traditional FA Cup tie you know what I liked about it both teams put out very very strong teams now uh, let me get into the player ratings in goal Petr Cech did his usual didn't do anything wrong Petr Cech was Petr Cech 8 out of 10 um, right back Hector Bellerin what a fantastic performance by Hector Bellerin one of his best this season um, he created two goals his pace he defended well really really excellent performance I'm going to give Hector Bellerin a 9 out of 10 brilliant performance today uh, at left back Kieran Gibbs I thought he played alright I mean some people have been saying that you know he passed back the ball too hard for Koscielny which I suppose he slightly did but Koscielny should still really have dealt with that a decent performance by Gibbs got forward really well as well I'm going to give Gibbs uh, 7 out of 10 uh, Lauren Koscielny in the middle uh, he dealt with everything pretty well to be honest he, he was pretty solid throughout however he did give away that first goal and that was a real calamitous mistake and for that he's only going to get 6 out of 10 I'm afraid Lauren Koscielny today got to do better than that um, Gabriel on the other hand I thought was excellent today really really solid brilliant all over the place all energy performance really staking a claim to start games now uh, 8.5 out of 10 for Gabriel really really good performance uh, we move on to the midfielders holding midfielder oh, it's raining here a lot isn't it <laughs> holding midfield, midfielder Callum Chambers uh, Callum Chambers I thought did very well today as well I'm going to give Callum Chambers a 7 out of 10 next to him Alex Iwobi quite impressed with Iwobi I was really impressed by his performance uh, I was expecting to see him out on the wing playing in the middle I thought he did very very well indeed a couple of good runs nearly scored a goal really confident performance for a guy stepping in for the first time in a full game uh, 7.5 out of 10 for Alex Iwobi Alex Oxley chamberlain as well started off a bit, bit sloppy gave the ball away a few times but he grew into the game and I really loved him in the middle there his turn of pace will trouble any defence all this guy's got to do is just get his confidence back really grew into the game hit the post later on um, I'm going to give him also a 7.5 out of 10 um, well played much improved by Alex Oxley chamberlain um, moving out now onto the wings uh, Theo Walcott bit on the periphery today decent enough game um, I'm gonna give Theo uh, 7 out of 10 on the other wing however Joel Campbell was brilliant today I'm really impressed by him scored a goal all action excellent performance by Joel Campbell for me the man of a match I'm gonna give him a 9.5 out of 10 really really played well um, Olivia Giroud, so somebody said in an interview earlier, just when I'm getting ready to slate him off, he scores a goal. He does that regularly. And again today, he was having a bit of a quiet time of things, but he popped up with a good goal, uh, played well. Uh, 7 out of 10 for Olivia Giroud. Um, would have got more if he'd have put a bit more effort in in the first half, but 7 out of 10 for Olivia Giroud. No, you know what, 7.5 out of 10, he scored a goal. So we've got to big him up for that. Um, Moving on to the uh, the bench and, and the players that came on. Uh, who did we have now? We had Aaron Ramsey came on, scored a goal, really turned the game when he came on as well. Played really, really well. Eight out of ten for Aaron Ramsey. That's the thing about Aaron Ramsey. He's a goal-scoring midfielder, very similar to what Lampard used to be for Chelsea. That's what he's starting to do now for Arsenal. Uh, very impressive by um, Aaron Ramsey. Jeff. Adelaide didn't get enough time I wanted to see more of him that was the only thing that was missing for me today that I wanted to see more of Jeff but for when he came on he did okay but because he's only on a short period of time can only give him a six because didn't really have enough time to have a look at him and uh, Mikel Arteta came on didn't put a foot wrong uh, made everything solid when he came on seven out of ten for Mikel Arteta I think that's everybody I've covered uh, let's rate the manager I'm going to give the manager today 9 out of 10 and the reason why I'm ranking him so high is that 
He took the FA Cup seriously. I was expecting a really, really weak team, and he didn't do that. He took it seriously, despite the game on Wednesday, despite the game on just coming up against Stoke, you know, and Liverpool, the tough games. He took this competition very seriously, and for that, he got his rewards, because you know what, Sunderland, they put out a strong team as well. So well done, Arsene Wenger, for putting out such a strong team. Really enjoyable game, really enjoyed it. Let's hope we can go and win the FA Cup three times. I think that's his best position to be honest because he, he pushed the attack he was driving forward mm. his flicks were coming off yeah but the thing is that we we're not going behind the Sunderland defense until Ramsey came in yeah. so Ramsey kind of changed the dynamics of the game and we got the winning goals and we we're very happy with that